Good afternoon, everybody. Hello, good afternoon. Ulysses, how are you feeling? Are you feeling better? More or less, buddy. Still a little bit sick? Oh, sorry to hear that. Have you taken any medications? Yeah, a lot. All right, so good hopefully afternoon. we're gonna get better soon. Hello, Hi. good afternoon, Emma Maria. Good nice afternoon. to see your full alchemist t-shirt. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Norma. Welcome. What's the anime behind you? That's wait, don't tell me that's Van Helsing, right? No way, no, no Van Helsing. It's the scene of proud to the full metal alchemist, Brotherhood. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I remember, I remember. The proud yeah. <laughs> scene, yes. Okay. Norma, how are you today? You look very fresh. Hi, thank you, teacher. <laughs> Nice. Yes, I am fresh. <laughs> it looks like you just took a shower. No, in the morning. Okay. But I don't I don't know why <laughs> I am fresh. <laughs> Maybe it, it isn't hot. Good for you. Here it's very hot right now. Hello, Alexandra. How are you? How are you doing? Sure. What Uli says? Normita, you said too much grease. Too much what? Too much grease. Grease, grease. Yeah. Excuse me, I don't understand. You mean grasa or what? Grease? Yeah. What do you mean? Uh, like the gelatin. I know. Only cream. Only cream, cream like collagen, collagen. Collagen. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. So let me just get the presentation open here. Hello, Dina. Welcome. Good afternoon, teacher. This is not Thank fourth you. class. This is our fifth class. All right, guys. We've got to our fifth class. Five days. Now the first week is over, and we finished working on unit number one we're gonna go today we're gonna start today unit number two and remember don't forget to send the homework by today if you haven't sent it yet and please send it all of you mandemelo todos even if it's pairs i want to get it from everybody hello robert oh oh I need you to do me a favor, uh, please, guys, con los nombres. Necesito que escriban el nombre completo. Porque ayer me puse a actualizar la, la, la asistencia. Y me dio casi la una de la mañana porque me tocó andar buscando por toda la lista. Que no los encontraba. Eh, Robert Peñate, por favor, si puedo poner el nombre completo. Eh, Dina de España también. I would, I would really appreciate it. Roberto Torres también. You are going to help me a lot. Teacher, our group sending, we we are sending the, the homework. No, to not to the group. Send it, send it to my to my number privately, not to the group. No, to your personal WhatsApp. Yes, to, my, yes. to me, privately. Yes. yes, not to the group. Okay. Please, guys, Robert Peñate and Roberto Torres. Remember, I wanna, I want to, I want you to please write down your full names. And right. well, I change. Hey, what's the presentation? All right, guys. Today we are going to talk about. Well, it's not something new because I know you already practiced it in the previous course. We are going to be talking about different things, especially preferences about different things. But before we start with the topic, I want you to tell me about yesterday's class. What do you remember about yesterday's class? Thank you, Roberto. Difference between much and many. We talked about how much and how many. What do we use them for? For what? Incountable or incountable? No. The much. We use them to ask for quantities, right? Yeah. 
countable and uncountable. uncountable. Which one is for countable? What What's the question for countable? How many? How many? How many? Oops. And what's the question for uncountable? How much? How much? How much? How many? How much? There you go. Can you give me some examples of countable things? How many apples do you have? All right. Apples. Another one? Tomatoes. Tomatoes. Thank you. Shoes. Which one? Candy. Shoes. Shoes. All right. Shoes, candies. Uh -huh. Tools. What, Ulises? Tools. Tools, all right, yep. Tools. 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 Children. Uh -huh. What, Dina? Children. Children, children, no S. Children, children is children. already plural, so the S is not necessary. Yes. Okay, children, children, two children, no children. Thank you, Dina. Now, can you give me examples of uncountable things? Uh, sugar, water. Honey. Sugar. Water, water, onions, Fried. money. Ah, money, 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 money. Money. What? Rice. Rice. Juice. Time. Juice. What? Time. The time. Well, time can either be countable or uncountable, right? Space too. When would you when in which cases do you use time as the concept? hours we can count the what Emma? the hours 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 yeah but the word time is also countable right when I ask you yeah. Emma how many times do you exercise during the day right I'm not talking about the time but I'm talking about the basis right that's the difference the okay do you have any questions with this topic? No? Was it difficult? Teacher, I have a question. Tell me, Dina. And when is one fruit is uncountable? One what? Fruit. fruit. Mm -hmm. It will depend on the context. If it if you refer to the fruits in general, that is uncountable. But if you refer to fruits different kinds apples bananas separately then is countable mm -hmm. it's like food the word food in general is uncountable how much? Uh -huh, how much food how much food but if you are specific with the food like fish meat i'm sorry fish uh, what hamburgers pizza etc that is countable okay Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Any other question? No? Okay. Just allow me a minute. I will take the picture. Black or no hot? No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right, guys, now we are going to go over some uh, speaking things here. So I, I, I need you to volunteer and, you know, be active in practice. Remember that during the day, during the day, how many, how much, how, wait, how many hours do you practice English during the day? Mm -hmm. How many hours do you practice English during the day? I sometimes practice um, two hours in the morning, and then I went in my class. Okay. And I I try to practice my English. Uh, my class after this this class. So right. I had class after this class at so my class start and five fifty five thirty and finish nine nine p.m. So you have another and class I, after this class. Yes, I had other class. About what? Uh, it is about a university. Oh, okay. 
Aí vai para Yes. a foto porque aí entraram mais. Vamos ver aqui. Guys, you need to be punctual. Remember, every minute, every second counts. Não se trampa. Okay, well, the point is that for, for most of you, this hour and a half is the only chance you have to practice. So take advantage of it. Take advantage of it. Now, let's go ahead and talk about your preferences. Start with cell phones. What do you prefer, guys? Galaxy or uh, or iPhones? Tell me about it. Android or iOS? Tell me your opinions about it. Okay. I will be honest with you. I really like uh, Android because... is more easier use than iPhone, than iOS. So for you, iPhones are easier than, than iOS. I mean, Android, Android are easier to iOS. of course, yes. for me. Okay. Yeah, I agree. I totally agree with you. Yeah. iPhones are very confusing. Uh, iPhone is so... Yes? The Android is cheap. Android is? Cheap. Chip, Android is cheap. Okay, you know, well, we'll talk about the price. It will depend. It will depend on the model, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Right. All right. Chip out the the application. All right. You have more applications. Okay. What else can you tell me? The application. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. I guess it's too expensive. The applications. So for iOS, you have to buy the applications. Yeah. Say, really. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. I have never used uh, iPhone, so I don't know. Uh huh. <laughs> yes, Andrea Gonzalez, what can you tell me about those type of cell phones? Um, I prefer Android teacher. Why? Because uh, because are my easy for me. Well, the Android is I don't know. I don't like Android. Android or iOS, the iPhone. Uh, well, iPhone I use the Cobra. I don't like it. <laughs> that's a walkie that's a walkie talkie okay. <laughs> walkie talkie all right uh-huh come on guys tell me more android battery is better than iphone you think Jose? why yes, yes. it's more durable really yes. yes all right so the so the iphone cell phones uh the charge doesn't last much yes. The pen of shine in the screen. Okay. The brightness, the brightness, the brightness, the brightness. The yeah. brightness, the brightness, yeah. People, brightness. How do you say acabarse de la batería? Se le acaba la batería. Well done. Hmm. No. Well done es bien cocido. <laughs> What, Dina? Ending. Ending. Uh, it is slow. Slowly. No. Slowly is slowly. Lentamente. Okay. The battery uh, is old. Eso es viejo. Ah, okay. If you want to uh, say acabarse. I'm sorry, Roberto. No, sorry. Acabarse in English is run. Run out. Oh. Like, for example, the iPhone's battery runs out very, how do you say, rapido, rapidamente? Fast. Quickly. Quickly. Fast. Quickly. Quickly. Uh-huh. Oh, teacher, why didn't you go to the Marc Antonio Solis concert? Because I ran out of money. Me acabo la feria. I ran out of money. So run out, run out, run out. All right, tell me more. Come on, Alexandra, in your opinion, well, what's better for you? I Androids or iPhones, I mean, or mm -hmm. iOS? Or in be specific case, about the brand, Samsung or iPhone? Okay, in my case, I prefer Android because I have uh, used it, uh, how do you say, like, all my life I have been using Android, but I will say that the iPhone camera is better. You think? Yes. Okay. It might be probably. <laughs> probably. Okay. What do you think, Jose Lopez? What's your opinion? I, I think for me, I prefer Android. But Why? I prefer 
Samsung because Samsung in this moment I think is lower quality compared to other brands in mm -hmm. the Android. For for example, for me, I, I think it's better uh, Xiaomi compared to Samsung. Uh, but I prefer Android because it's it's lower compared to the iPhone and a good quality. Okay. All right. Yeah, I totally agree with you guys. I will stay forever with Android rather than iPhones or iOS. They are too difficult to be used and confusing. But yeah, Alexandra, you are right. Some iPhone cell phones, the cameras are very nice. Oh, right. No more talking about cell phones. Now tell me your opinions about these. Beach or forest? Uh-huh. Tell me. I prefer forest. Why, Giancarla? Uh, so I like to I like doing exercise. Okay. And I prefer walk uh, or running. And so fill me with this environment. Feel me um comfortable for me. All right. Okay. I prefer I prefer those places. <laughs> yes, what is it? My family live in, in Costa del Sol. Really? Uh, all guys have the bar skin. Yeah. Living near the beach is not good. No you good. get yeah. you get somewhere. Okay. Come on. The water is solid. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sandra. The water is in is solid. The, the what? Water, the the weather. The water in the beach and uh, is the is the flower is different. The water. The, water, the, the, yes. the flavor really. The flavor, yes. <laughs> How is yes. it? I don't like I don't like this water. Really? Is, yes. it, is it different? Why? Yeah. Mm, salada, saladita. Yes. How do you say saladita in English? Salty. I don't know. Salty. 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 Salado. Like me mm -hmm. sometimes. But if you say saladito, como cuando les cocinan, right? Stone, para yes. no prenderlo, está saladito, está saladito, a little salty, right? All right. Yes. I don't like the water. Okay, <laughs> yeah, because the, maybe because the, 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 I don't know, do they take the water from the sea? Yes. Probably, right? My, my, my... And it's not filtered appropriately. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you, Sandra. In your opinion, Stephanie Rodriguez, what's better? What do you prefer, the beach or the mountains? Uh, in my opinion, I prefer the beach because I can swim in or I I can't take a sun and I don't like a uh, run or or walk for uh <laughs> me too <laughs> how, how do you say mm, un momento largo for a long time uh, mm -hmm. for a long time only just just for a while but not for a long time sí. yes <laughs> okay so you'd rather go to the beach instead of the on the mountains. Stephanie Ramirez, in your case. Uh, the two plays each. You like them both? But what what I mean, there are some some good things and bad things about both both places. So yeah. what's good about the beach? And what's bad about the forest or vice versa? Um, because I like I like to to listen to the waves of the sea. Uh huh. And okay. I get to to swim. Okay. And in a forest. Um, because I like uh, not not to nature not to. nature nature. Nature, yeah. Nature. Okay. Uh, and about the weather, what place that uh, what place have better weather? In your opinion, Stephanie.
Repeat. What place has better weather? Mm, for me, too. <laughs> Both, really? You, you like hot weather? Yes. Why? Really? You like the hot? <laughs> uh, mm, I like fresh. I like hot. Okay. Uh, uh, como decir, how do you say? Como no voy todos los días, cuando voy, me gusta. Me gusta. How do you say, como no voy todos los días? Ese, ese es, that como, how would you say it? That como, como, you can use sin in that case, since. Since I don't what? Voy. Don't go. Todos los días. Don't go every day. Mm -hmm. every day. Since I don't go every day. Uh huh. What else did you say, Stephanie? Uh, How do you say? No me importa el clima. Um, no mute, no, Alexandra. I see no, your no, lips no, moving, no. but I can hear. <laughs> Maybe I don't uh, care the weather or I don't mind, mind the, weather. the weather. I don't mind. I don't mind the weather. Well, since I don't go every day, I don't mind the weather. I like it hot sometimes. I like it cold sometimes. Teacher, now I will I will stick with cold weather. Yes, Alexander? Uh, if that okay, if we say as I don't instead of <laughs> since, no. Sign, mm -hmm. since, since, since. 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 As is for comparing. Like when you say, like when you, for example, when you say, I work as a teacher, right? Como un profesor. It's like I'm making the reference or comparing my job as a teacher. Or like when you say, a tiger is as fast as a lion. So you are comparing, they have the same speed. But in this case, it's a little bit different. Mm hmm all right now let's go to the next one well talking about weathers catherine marroquin what what would you prefer cold weathers or hot weathers mm, i think that the cold weather because uh, where the where the weather is is cold i feel that i want to to be in my bed, I don't want <laughs> to do anything. And I enjoy the time uh, watching a movie and for the reason. You can use a jacket. You can use a jacket. How do you say how do you say in English bajo la colcha? Under blanket. What? Under blanket. Mm, yeah, blanket, it's an option, or you can also say sheets. Be careful with the pronunciation here. Under the sheets, yes. mm -hmm. yeah. When it's when it when it when the weather is cold, I get under the sheets and I sleep better. And you, Emma? I prefer cold weather because I hate. Uh, how can I say sudar? sudar? Mm. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Sweating. I hate sweating. <laughs> I hate sweating. Yeah, me yeah. too. I hate it. I, hate it. I don't like and, to feel all and sweat. When I sweating, I have allergies in my skin. <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay. Now, Emma, in this case, I sweating, but the the el, the ¿qué sería? the noun the noun is okay. sweat. Oh, bueno, en okay. este caso sería el verbo. When I sweat. Okay. Este es el nombre, sweating, sudor, sweat, sudar. So when I sweat, I get allergies. Or yeah. when I am sweating, progressive. Okay. Really, you sweating. got allergies. Allergies, yeah. And you get all red? Yeah. Do you say ronchita, ronchitas? What do you, what, what do you call that? What, how, what do you call that in English? Like the salpullido, for example. Uh-huh, yeah. How do you say that in English? No idea. Rush. 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 Yeah. 
Price. Oh, okay. What is the coldest place you have been, Emma? Or that you know? Well, uh, when here in the I where I was born. King. I was born in Nuevo Cuscatlán. I was working. Weather... What? I was working. No, where where I where, where I was born. King. No. Born, born. nació, nació, born. born. Yeah. Oh, okay. The place where I was born is the the weather is cold. Antiguo Cuscatlán. No, Nuevo Cuscatlán. I only know Antiguo. What's Nuevo? Uh, yeah. Nuevo is in Santa Tecla. Oh, and it's cold. Yeah. Okay. Well, when I was born, it was cold. But right now, uh, no. with the houses, a lot of houses, and I don't know how can I say residenciales and all that Residentials, kind of thing. neighborhoods. How do, you say, how do you say cambio climático in English, people? Uh -huh. don't, I don't, you don't know change climate i don't know <laughs> climate changes yeah, okay. climate change. yeah everything has changed i remember like 10 15 years ago i used to go to la ruta de las flores and i always wore a sweater yeah. in the <laughs> afternoons now if you are if you go to la ruta de las flores a taco a paneca or any of those places and you wear a jacket, you start to sweat. It's yeah, very yeah. hot. In the yeah. past, it was very cold. Okay. You, Norma, what do you prefer, cold or hot? Cold, teacher. Why? Because uh, I sleep well. Yes. All day long, all, all night long. And uh, I I wear sweet, uh, sweater. Sweater. Uh -huh. What is I, the... I like I like. Okay. Cold. What I, is the coldest place you have ever been here in El Salvador? In Huayua. Really? Or, or Apaneca. But a long time ago? No. Uh, Recently? In, Tal, in, in yes. December. Uh -huh. In December, last year? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. All right. Yes, Carla, I totally agree with you. In my opinion, the mo I mean the coldest place in El Salvador is El Pital. If you don't know it, I recommend you to go. But it's not my fault if you don't come back. <laughs> because it's terrible, especially in December. The first time I went there was in December, and I couldn't sleep at all. It was too freezing cold. Yeah. And the hottest place, what's the hottest pla place you know? No, okay. San Miguel. Yeah. <laughs> Terrible. San Miguel, Usulután, La Unión. Terrible. The weather there is terrible. Where, Sandra? Santa Rosa de Lima. Santa Rosa de Lima, La Unión. Yeah. Terrible. Yeah. The weather there. Yeah. You want to be naked on the streets there. <laughs> yeah. Terrible. Terrible. Place to agua caliente. Where, Ulises? No place compared to agua caliente. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. I think I'm gonna do now transportation. What's better, bus or car? Roberto Peñate, tell me your opinion. Freaking mosquitoes. Bus or car, Roberto Peñate. Okay. Um, here in El Salvador, I think that. The car is better than bus because, as you know, um, we have a how do you say pessimo servicio? Bad service. Bad service. Okay, yeah, bad, bad service. service with the bus. And I saw in other places like London, England, like Japan, and the bus is other level. Uh, the drivers bus drivers um are very long how do you say that? Mm, razonables reasonable or considerados the the oh. bus drivers are very con considerate 
considerate. Yeah. Considerate. Um, uh -huh. okay. And that's why I make haste the, the car. Do you, have, do you have a car? No. Oh, okay. And for you, Santos, Fidelina, what's better, bus or car? Okay, I don't have a car. I prefer bus because always arrive by bus uh, is very, it's very comfortable for me because I can see different, different panorama. How do you say panorama, teacher? How do you say panoramas in English, guys? Views. Lack of practice or lack of practice. Maybe. Views. Okay. Maybe you can say landscapes as well. More views. Mm -hmm. Deeper views. Beautiful views. More landscapes. Yes, okay. that's true. And the best thing is that you can see it because you are not concentrated driving, right? And when, <laughs> you, when you drive, you can't get distracted. Okay. Yes. And for you, Ulysses, bus or car? I like the car. <laughs> you, you will prefer car. Why? Yeah. It's better. Why? It's personal. It's personal. Private. Personal? Private. Private? Yeah. So you don't you don't you don't like making friends in the class? Uh it's no not sure. Why? I have I have made a lot of friends on the bus. I yeah. even met a girlfriend once. Different people. Yeah, different people. I mean Yeah, you meet people. people. I yeah. even I even made a girlfriend once on the bus. <laughs> I traveled from Sonsonate to San Salvador and we became boyfriend and girlfriend at that, in that time. <laughs> we ha it was a one day relationship. For that no. idea, good. What? For that, that idea is better. Yes. <laughs> and also, in my opinion, uh, traveling by bus is like being rich. Mm. Like having a personal chauffeur. Yes. <laughs> And you can sleep. And when you drive, you can't sleep. Um, yeah. Because if you sleep, you die. I prefer the bus, teacher. Why, Sandra? Well, because I had you driving. driving. No, you don't. I had you driving. You I can't drive? Like no, yes, but I don't like it. <laughs> but you should learn. It's necessary. Driving is necessary. Yes, because only imagine. <laughs> you only imagine? I drive only images. <laughs> <laughs> On your imagination. No. No, I wear emergencies because oh, I, emergencies. I'm sorry, for no, emergencies. Emergency. For emergencies, yes, I driving in the hospital or lots of place, but for my good stuff, I don't like I don't like I don't like like driving no. I don't like it. <laughs> you would rather travel by bus. Yes. Okay. okay. This word people rather is like embes de. It's like like when you say I would I would rather travel by bus. En vez del carro el bus o preferiría preferiría preferir travel by bus. It will depend on what you're on what you're going probably. If you travel long distances, I prefer to go by car because I go faster. Yes. Yeah, in the bus you have to wait. Have last started. the last weekend, the last weekend I went to visit my friend in San Vicente mm. from here, Sonsonate, and I took six hours wow. to get to his house. I left here at eleven a.m. Mm -hmm. and I arrived at his house at five p.m. Wow. Yeah, and when I go by car, I only take one hour and a half. Yes, yes. Yeah, because I like I like to drive fast. I like yeah. the speed. And the bus is more cheap. For traffic, Cheaper. I'm sorry? It's for the traffic. Yeah, the for traffic. The and if you travel by car, you can look for different yeah. roads, right? Yes, yes. There's no traffic. 
All right, guys. Thank you so much for sharing your opinions. Now, just a small feedback here. Hey, ¿qué pasó? Esto no iba aquí. Um, there were just a, some couple couple of things here. What is the comparative form of easy? Easier. Easier, right? It's not more easy. Easier. What do you think about this sentence? What do you think about this? Is this correct? No. No. Why not? Because you're using ing. And? And you have to use infinity, uh, the verb in infinity form. Exactly. When we use the auxiliary can, the verb is in infinitive. We don't say swimming. This is not correct. I can swim. swim. Mm -hmm. El baile de swim. <laughs> and once again, guys, remember, I, ex I, I, I remember I explained this to you, uh, to you yesterday. I like. Remember, we have two options. What is the first one? I like to. I like to. Like, for example, I like to run or I like running. 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 Either or, but no, I like run. This is not appropriate either. Okay, be careful with that. Remember that. These are not correct. Ah, and the brillo, like the la pantalla. Shine is like brillar. The video is brightness. brightness. So the battery runs out because the brightness is too high. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Sister. Okay. Good. All right, guys. I show you this because talking when we talk about preferences, we usually compare, right? Different things. And for comparing, what do we use? What do we use to compare different things? Then, we then, use comparative or superlative adjective. When we use a comparative adjective, we use them. How many things do we compare? Uh, two persons. Two or more things. Only two things, right? Uh, and when we use superlative, one we compare? One hundred. No. Only the one? Thing. <laughs> two or more? And we refer to the one with the highest quality in the group, right? With superlatives. And there are some rules to follow. Mm, let's see, for example, cheap. What's the comparative form? Cheaper. Cheaper. Cheaper, cheaper than, right? Don't forget this word. And it's not that, it's then. And the superlative? Cheapest. The? Cheapest. Cheapest. How about this one? Big. What's the comparative form? Bigger. Bigger. How do you spell it? B I G G I E R. Yes, in this case, we duplicate the consonant, right? There are some additives where we duplicate the consonant. Bigger than. And the, and the superlative? Biggest. The biggest. Don't forget that. Yes. The biggest. Hamburguesas are carbon, right? Biggest. Beautiful. More beautiful. More beautiful. 
more beautiful in the superlative. Ah, more beautiful. Then, 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 most beautiful. The most, the most. The most. Yeah. And good. Best, better, better, better than and the best, the best, the best. the best. and bad. Worse, 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 worse than and the worst, the worst, the worst. The worst. All right, nice, nice. So this uh, this is the vocabulary we use to compare different things. Let's go over some exercises. Let me just open here. I'm gonna show you some adjectives here and you wanna tell me the comparative and the superlative form. So, do you see my computer screen? Yes. What yes. do you see? Yes. One, two, three, number. All right. So, I will open the boxes and you tell me the comparative and superlative form of the adjectives inside the boxes. Number one? Comparative? Superlative? The oldest. Very good. Number two. Beautiful. More beautiful. More beautiful. Most beautiful. Most beautiful. Number three. Oops. Sorry. Wow. This one. Thinner than. Thinner than and. The cleanest. The cleanest. Very good. Number three. Angrier than. And the angriest. Can I say more angry? Uh, the ang no. angrier. angrier. Angrier, right? Angrier or the angriest. Okay. Number four. Nicer. Nicest. Nicer than and the superlative. The, the nicest. nicest. The nicest. Number five. Sweeter. Sweeter. Sweeter, Sweeter or. The sweetest. Sweetest. The sweetest. The sweetest. Number six. Cheaper than. Cheaper than. Superlative. The cheapest. The cheapest. Very good. Number seven. Earlier. Earlier. Earlier than. And the superlative. The earliest. Can I say more early? Uh, no. No, right? Earliest. Earlier or more early. I mean, earlier or the earliest. This one? Better. 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 Superlative? The best. Nice. Best. Number 10. This one? More, more intelligent. More intelligent. And the superlative? The most, the most intelligent. intelligent. Nice. This one? Hotter. 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 One T or double T? Post. Double T. Double T. Double T. Double T. And, the, and the superlative? The hottest. The hottest. The hottest. The hottest. This one? Wait. Oops. Younger. Younger than. And the superlative? The youngest. The youngest. And this one? One year. One year then, and superlative? The funniest. The funniest. The funniest. Yes. And this one? Bigger. Bigger. And superlative? The biggest. Thank you. And the last one? Worse. Worse than, and superlative? The worst. The worst. Oh. Right. Questions about the vocabulary? All right. Now, let's see. Emma, can you give me an example of a comparative or superlative using angry? Um, my dog is angrier than my cat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Eh, José López, we clean. One more time. Clean. We clean, clean. Uh, clean. Cleaner. Yeah. Give me an example. Use it in a context. I can imagine because well, my house is is the cleaner comparator with my house, the my sister. I don't know. <laughs> I need to... Right, all right. First of all, is it okay if you say the cleaner? Cleaner. Cleaner? Uh -huh, cleaner is the, the... My uh, house is cleaner than... And how do you say in English, la casa de mi hermana? The... House. The house. My the... daughter house. Daughter my house. sister's house. Okay, see, huh? sister's house. <laughs> my sister's house. Yes, remember, if you say the house of my sister, it says Spanglish. Right? Uh -huh. The house of my sister is Spanglish. Literal translation. My sister's house. Roberto Torres, can you give me an example using uh, intelligent? Okay. Uh, okay. Who, who is the most intelligent person in the class? The teacher. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, you are very intelligent. All right, all right, all right. Very good. Well, this is not complicated for you. You already dominated. Now it's time for you to talk. Please, everybody, get ready with your cameras on because you are going to be discussing the following questions. Um, take a screenshot, please. Take a screenshot of these I mean, of these questions. And you are going to discuss the questions. And in the answers, please try to use comparatives and superlatives. Let me give you some examples. Ask me some of the questions. Ask me five questions. Ask me five questions. What kind of movie do you like? like? What kind of movies do I like? Well, I like different kinds of movies, but in my opinion, Marvel, Marvel movies are better than romantic movies, but romantic movies are like more emotional too. <laughs> I like them both, but in my in my opinion, the best are horror movies. Yes. Do you see? Comparative and superlatives. Ask me another question. Do you like going to the beach? No, I don't like going to the beach. In my opinion, going to a mountain is better because the weather is colder. Uh, you can have better time with your friends and you can relax more than in the beach. In the beach, the weather is too hot. So I would rather go to, the, uh, to a mountain instead of the beach. One more? Yes? What, what, what kind of music do you like? Reggaeton. Well, <laughs> have you seen? Have you seen? Have you seen that that new about Flow GPT? Yeah. yeah? Have you it seen that? Great. I like uh, that song, the Bad Bunny song with Flow GPT. I like it. <laughs> That's okay. better. But yeah. Well, Carla, I don't like reggaeton now. For me, the old reggaeton was better. Is the better. It was better, like Don Omar or Alexis, Alexis Tito, Tito El Bambino. Yeah, their songs were better than the reggaeton. Yes. Body. The yes. songs nowadays don't say anything. <laughs> Just garbage. Yes. <laughs> yeah. All right. So that's how you're going to reply. Give your opinions and try to use comparatives and superlatives while you answer. Now I will send you to the breakout rooms for a couple of minutes and practice. Keep your cameras on. Ah, one recommendation. Cuando hagan las preguntas, no vayan uno por uno, sino que hagan una pregunta y discutan a todos. Porque si se ponen uno por uno, es lo mismo como que estemos acá, los demás así. Solo viendo y escuchando. You know, everybody interact at the same time, okay? So let me get the rooms ready. 
right? Go ahead. Go right ahead, go right ahead, go right ahead. No sé las demás. Vaya, ¿y ahora? Yes. Bien. Eh, voy a comenzar entonces. Eh, a ver, le voy a hacer la pregunta. ¿Alguien está en inglés? Voy a comenzar entonces. Are you starting? Are you I'm going now? to start. I'm going to start. I'm going to start. And Maylin, um, do you like going to the beach? Yes, I like beach because uh, relax uh, the weather. I like the uh, the shower in the in the in the beach. Um, Maylin, este... what is it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Remember, Maylin. you can also discuss the questions at the same time. Okay. In my case, uh, I like going to the beach because... Uh, no, and to me, I prefer to go to the mountain because the views are beautiful. Um, I do, I hate the beach because when you go to the beach, and your skin burn and and I hate the stresses. I don't know how do you say. It. Uh, I I stress too much. Ah, uh, stress too much in the beach. I will be honest with you. I like. For me, it's most beautiful than mountain, but I can swim, for example. But the mountain is beautiful, I get. But the sunset, the beach is, is I think it's better because you can just you can say the sea and or whatever whatever thing in the beach is. In my case, I love um the mountain. Why? Mm -hmm. 
Natalie? She lost connection. Uh, oh, because, uh, um, yes? And play with my brothers. Okay. I love the song. Ah, uh, Roberto Torres, you say that you heard uh, um, the beach. Um, what do you think about uh, sea, sea soup? Sea, sea food? No, sea soup. Sea soup. I don't know uh, how it's pronounced. What? Sea, sea food. Ah, sea food. Sea, seafood. Seafood, yeah. I love the seafood, fish, uh, crabs. Uh, I love it. What about you? Do you like? I like it. No, I like it. I, I like it. I don't know how do you say camarones in English. Shrimp. Uh, how? Crab? Shrimps. Shrimps. I love shrimps. Yeah. yeah. Guys, remember to interact with everybody. You have other classmates. Yeah. Let me. Um, I like to the to the beach. Because I usually don't go to the beach. And when I go to the beach, it's an occasion special. And I enjoy the place and, and enjoy also the moment with my family. You like the coconut with a little umbrella? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. Melanie's on the way. gone. Continue. Next question. Uh, what is your favorite thing to do? My favorite uh, thing to do is feed the animals in the farm. Oh, okay. Ladies, continue. What oh, is your sorry. favorite thing to do? Uh, what was the question? Sorry. What is your favorite thing to do? Hello. In my case, I like to play soccer because I like to share a good moment with my friends. Um, that's all. Okay. Well, in my case, I enjoy uh, watching movies, but also I enjoy reading books. But it's a that I, I don't, I usually don't, don't do it, but, but I like it. Stephanie, Alexandra. In my case, um, I like to read the manguas or webtoon in my free time, and also in my new my my new favorite thing is the is to go the park with my brother. Okay. I don't know. Think. Um, no, not, I don't have. <laughs> my favorite thing is to spend time with my children. Um, nunca lo había pensado, how do you say? What is your favorite thing to do? So, like, what's your favorite hobby? What's your favorite oh. activity? Okay. Mm -hmm. Like he said, uh, spending time with his children, going to the beach. I don't know. Uh, my oh, maybe. I don't. What do you say? Um, I said, um, origami. 
A origami. ver, amigurumi. No, amigurumi se llaman. Amigurumi. Yes, I What like is that? amigurumi. What is that? I am the crochet. Oh, okay. The llama. Yeah. Okay. Um, I, when I'm my son, I, I'm making a plant zombies. I'm making a plant. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the amigurumi, así se llama. Oh, oh, okay. Yes, amigurumi. That's my... My thing favorite. My favorite thing. I love it. I love it. I My love favorite it. I thing to do. Okay. Yeah. I continue. <laughs> I like to watch TV, but I think it is better watch a series on my tablet on the TV because I can to watch in a, any place. Okay, um, Josue, do you like to watch TV? Uh, not really, but I sometimes watch TV uh, once a week, and I love to watch horror movies. Stephanie, do you like to watch TV? I don't like watch TV, but... I watch TV because I communication student and a subject. Uh, how do you say exigent? Require, do you can say require? Require? Uh, be quiet. Require, require, require. Require They require me require me to, to watch TV or what? to watch TV and a specific the news. Oh, okay. Okay, I I like watch TV. I like to watch TV uh, on weekend because in week I don't have I don't have a, a... hello. Hey Roberto, what are you doing here alone? Oh, sorry. No, I have a problem with my PC, but Okay. I I leave the the breakout room, so I got uh I stay alone. For maybe a two minutes only because I have a problem with my PC, so I fix the problem now. So All right. I will fix later. Okay, perfect. Everybody's coming out. All right, people, let's discuss the questions. Movies. What are the best type of movies for you guys? Oh, let's see. Wait, Alexandra, for you. If I tell you, Alexandra, let's go to the movies, and there are horror movies, action movies, comedies, or romantic. Which ones would you prefer? Mm, I will prefer action movies and comedy movies because I think that those are the are the most interesting interesting type type of movies. Interesting. Interesting type of movies. In your opinion, who is the best comedian? Or the best comedy actor? Mm, my favorite is Adam Sandler. Really? Um, You like Adam Sandler? Okay. What do you think about Jim Carrey? Yes, I like Jim Carrey. You like Jim Carrey, Carla? Yes, Okay. but I think that Adam is better than Adam. <laughs> Are <laughs> you Adam Sandler? yeah, Or... yeah. The two actors are are good. True. How about Johnny Depp? Do you think No. he's a good comedian actor? Comedy actor? Um, No. just No. in um Pirates how do you of the say Caribbean? Pirates? Yeah. Only Pirates of the Caribbean, yeah. He makes different, he has different roles in different movies, right? Okay. Now let's see. Mm, music. In your opinion, Nydeline. Hi, Nydeline. What have you been? 
Nidalee, what kind of music is, be is the best for you and why? I am English music is the better because I... The better or the best? The best. <laughs> because I care to learn English with them. And who, in your opinion, who is the best English singer? I listen to uh, Chinese singer, Jackson. Chinese? Do you like paper? It's Chinese. Jackson, Chinese. what? Wang. Jackson, Wang. W A N G. The BTS. But that's Korean music, music, no, isn't it? <laughs> isn't it K pop? It's Chinese. Yeah. It's Chinese. Get off him, teacher. K pop. What, Roberto? Nothing. But. I mean, K-pop is Korean music, right? Yeah, <laughs> but he um is complicated. He it's is not... from a Korean band, but he is Chinese, and he. <laughs> All right, I don't know anything about K-pop. I will say nothing about it. Okay, Nadelin, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Korean, I only like dramas. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Norma, do you like to watch TV? Yes, I love watch TV. Really? Yes, I like dramas. Only right. time I watch dramas. What's the best for you? Eh, aterrizaje de emergencia. Oh, okay. I haven't watched that one. This is better. Better than, than the other one? No, it's the best. Is that but is that sentimental and sad or it's a little bit better than because the one I watch is Escalera al Cielo and I spent the whole series crying. No, because no. it's very sad. The uh, aterrizaje emergencia is is comic and uh, is senti is sentimental. Sentimental it's, and it's, comedy. It's, it's, it's like a combination. Nice. It's very nice. Okay. <laughs> Nice. Now let's see. I want to ask Maylin Toledo. What type of food do you like to eat, Maylin? I like the typical food. Okay. And what's better or what's the best for you? Uh, pupusas, um, bean, eggs. Okay. I like what else? Um, yuca. Yucca. What's better, fried or boiled? Fried. <laughs> really? Yes. Pesca? Uh, or no pepesca? Chicharrón? With pork? chicharrón? With pork? Yes. Pork. Pork. No pepesca. Pork <laughs> is better than pepesca. No. Yeah. <laughs> yes. pepesca. Okay. Roberto, <clears throat> do you like... Uh, do you like exercising, Roberto Tor uh, Peñate? Uh, no, no. Oh. Mm, I don't like, but it's necessary. You don't like exercising? I do, but I don't like. Uh, but it's necessary to do that. It's necessary. What uh, what yeah. exercise do you do? I'm trying to do calisthenic. Really? Yeah. But that's hard. It has to be very, very strong to do it. Yeah. You know, um, last week I do exercise and I try to do um, uh, two other things and almost uh, almost broke my back. I, I don't know. How do you say it? Um, Espalda. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, calisthenics is very difficult. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice, nice, Roberto. And you, Roberto Torres, do you like video games? Uh, I will be honest with you, I don't like video games. So, yes, but not because uh, currently I don't play any video games, but when I was a kid, I played a lot of video games. So, Ooh. it's fine, but 
No play. Don't and that's play. the best in your opinion. Or what was what was the best video game when you were uh for you me, were a kid? More, but it's the best video game in the PS2. Which one? If I, uh, um, Mortal Kombat. Oh, you like fighting games? Yeah, I, I love it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Street, uh, Street Fighter. I don't like Street Fighter. Well, Ulises, what did you say? No, I like it. Marvel yes. versus Capcom is good. Yes. <laughs> Marvel versus Capcom. Yeah, yeah. Street Fighter. What was the other one? What was the other one? They were that was a samurai. There was another guy. They Call were, of Duty. Which Killer one? Instinct two. Uh, Call of Duty. No, it wasn't Killer <laughs> Instinct. There was a samurai with a dog. There was a ninja. There was another one. I don't remember the name. Shadow, 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 something. A street Fighter. No, it wasn't Street <laughs> Fighter. That was a good one too. All right. And I think that you uh, you said uh, Assassin's Creed, no? No, but Assassin's Creed is like an RPG. That was a fighting yeah. game too. Fighting games. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In my opinion, the best video games are shooting games and racing games like Need for Speed and Call of Duty. Those are the what? best. What? Yeah, you can remake the most the, the Need for Speed most wanted. I want it. I want it. <laughs> right, guys. I was playing my computer when it's I was a teenager. <laughs> yeah, it was better to have an emulator. And cheaper too. Yeah. <laughs> American Sniper. What? Who is it? American <laughs> Sniper. American Fighter. No, American Sniper. American Sniper. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that was a, a good one too. <sighs> I miss my, my childhood. Mario Bros. <laughs> of course. Of course. Total respects for Mario's, Mario Bros. Saga, right? Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> He will never die, like in the in Mario 64. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's continue here. Um, I mean, let's go over this writing exercise very quickly. We're going to complete these sentences with the correct comparative form. What will be here? What will be the sentence here? Sarah? Sarah is busier than Mary. Sarah is busier than Mary. The number two? The sun is hotter. Hotter with one T only? Two T. Than the moon. Two T's, right? Hotter? Than the moon. Than the moon. Next? Than the hair. Larger than, don't forget the than, larger than. The next? Elephants are bigger. One G? Double G, bigger than horses. Number six? Action movies are exciting. Mm, comparative? More exciting. More exciting. Exciting? Then, right? Don't forget the then. This restaurant is better. Is better than that restaurant. Salads is more easier. Blue more healthier. More, more healthier than hamburgers. Next. I think we can serve nicer. Than nicer than weekdays. I agree. Finally, Friday. Finally. TGIF, right? TGIF. Lions. <laughs> Are are more dangerous. 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 Yes. The next one, the sun. The sun is fire. More fire. No, it's fire. Fire. Spell it out. F 
A A I I R. Mayer. No. One more time. Uh huh. <laughs> Anybody? Uh, help, I, her, help her, help her. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> Spell it. No. no. Parter, you said like this. Parter with double T. Hmm. Hmm. I. I. I you no. Know, more. H H H H. Farther. Farther. Farther than. I. I. And the number eleven. Uh, Miss you. Mosquito. Down. Which one? And the number eleven. Uh, Miss you. Uh, down. Down the rest of What? Ah, then the number ten. Sorry. The number ten. Thank you, thank you. Number 12? That hotel is worse than the worst than worse than worse than this one. The number 13? Are faster faster than bicycles. Then bicycles. Number 14? Comedies is funny. Is or are? Are funnier like this? No, no, no. no. We, I, 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 like, like this. Eliminate why? No. Eliminate why? Yes. Like this? I, I. Yes. Very good. Yes. In these cases, we change the why to the for the I, right? Perfect. Yeah. And the last one, number fourteen. Is I is more nervous. I am. I am. I am, I am. I am. <laughs> nervous -er than my friend, right? Than my friend. Right? Correct? Yes, right? I am nervous -er than my friend. Yeah. Yes. Yes or no? More nervous than. Yes, it's not nervous or people, more it's nervous. more nervous. More nervous. Nervous than my friend. Very good, very good. Now let's talk a little bit more before we finish the class. Here I have some things. Horror, romantic movies, go out or stay home, romantic music or reggaeton, watch TV or read books. Let's see, Santos Lopez. Talk to us and give us your opinion between uh, horror or romantic movies. <laughs> I like I like romantic in the whole <laughs> Which ones are better for you? The better is um, the horror. The better or the best? The best horror. And what is your what is your favorite horror movie? Mm. La Casa Embrujada House. The Haunted House? house? Uh, yeah. I haven't watched that one. Okay. The Haunted House. Okay. And for you, Ulysses? No one. <laughs> How do you say ninguna? But when you are talking about things, because no one is about people. Nothing. No. Either. Nothing is nothing. Not either, either is when you have different things. It's not any. You can say no. that, or you can also say this. None. 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 Ninguna. Ninguno. None. None. Or any. So what kind of movies do you like? Any. Any. Who listen? The war movies. Really? Yeah. Okay. So you like, 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 like the what's the name of the movie with Sylvester Stallone, Jason Staten? Rocky. No. 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 The uh, reality movies. Re no. What's the name of this movie? What's the name of the movie? Help me. Help me. 
Porque sí, Sylvester Stallone, Jason Staten, Jet Li. No, en español, los mercenarios, no. Ya, pero en inglés, ¿cuál es el nombre? En inglés, sí. No, 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 of all the time, okay? All right, that's movies. Now, let's see about this. Go out or stay home? Give me your opinions. What's better and why? Stay home. For you, Roberto, go out, why? Yeah, because when you go on home, you, you can well for home and uh, drive stress or feel, feel better than stay home. For me, stay home is boring, it's so boring than staying out in the park or yeah. where place in the street for me okay. it's better all right all right thank you roberto people how do you say this is this is in english stressful no that doesn't exist you can say relieve stress Ah, oh, relief stress. Or distress. Yes. And guys, um, capsule yeah. informativa. Y relaxing. Yeah, but relax is different because relax is relajarse. And this is literally desestresarse. Capsule informativa. Ing versus ing. Um... When we use adjectives ending in ed or ing, they have different usages. We can use them to give our opinion about something or to express how we feel about something. So when we give, when we give our opinion, we, we use ending in ed and when we oops when we talk about well when we say how we feel we use adjectives and then in ing no sé si habían estudiado esto like for example board and boring if i say i am bored That's this is boring. the way i feel right but if i say uh for example no voy a leer la mente. the class is boring this is your opinion so in that case if you say for me, going out, I uh, know, for me, staying home is bored or is boring? It's, it's boring. It's boring. It's boring. I feel bored when I stay when I stay home. Right? Or this one. Mm, this one. Scared. No, it's not. I'm interested. Versus interesting. I can say I am interest interested in learning another language. language. Mm -hmm. Learning languages is interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So be careful with this. When we use adjectives in these cases with ed or ing, ed is your feeling, ing is your opinion. Okay. Capsule informativa. Questions about this? No? Oh, it's fine. All right, let's go back here. Aha, uh -huh. Alexandra, you, you you all have a different opinion than Roberto, right? You said you prefer stay home. Why? Um, because 
you can have your own privacy. How do you say in English, tiempo a solas? Stay alone at home? I don't know. <laughs> time, time for in? myself. <laughs> time alone. Ah, time alone. <laughs> time alone. All right. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Now, watch TV or read books? Catherine, in what, what's better for you? Watch TV or read books? Uh, well, I enjoy the book, the book, but I I think that it's better. It's, it's better. It's the best read because I sometimes feel that the... How do you say this? Vista, el sentido o vista de lo que veo. El sentido de que la vista está cansada. Sight. We have Sight. Five, five senses, right? Five senses. They are sight. Sight. Mm, okay. Smell. Pepe. Smell, uh, taste, mm. hearing, hearing, and touch. Estos son nuestros cinco sentidos. Sight, smell, taste, hearing, touch. Tacto. Okay, so you feel your side gets tired, Catherine? Yes. When you are reading? No, when I I think I think that when you you read, it's a way that you you uh, make other activity that don't see uh, only the things virtual. Okay. All right. Yeah, I agree with you. I prefer reading the book than watching TV. Giancarla, fast food or homemade food? No, I prefer homemade food. Why? Because it's more healthy. More healthy? Healthier. Yes. Or healthier? Healthier, sorry. It is healthier. Okay, but yeah. you can make a homemade hamburger and that will still be fast food. Uh, no, but it is always, <laughs> it is no healthier. It's not healthy. In that case, it's not healthy. All right. And for you, Emma, homemade or fast food? Depends. On what? <laughs> um, when I, uh, I don't know how can I say when I, when I have, a Celebration? No. Uh, yeah, maybe celebration, but, um, when the women women's are pregnant, uh, oh, say, <laughs> say a word, yeah. <laughs> I don't remember. Me... When I was when I was um, I don't know how can I say antojo. <laughs> uh, no, but you are not an antojo. Well, for your husband, yes, but you don't are you don't are an antojo. You feel, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and when I have, uh, when I have a whim, a whim uh, to eat a fast food, I eat fast food. But sometimes I like okay. to to do the homemade food. <laughs> oh, okay. For pregnant women, you have cravings. Cravings. Pregnant woman. So, whim is in general, like you have an antojo, algo que en pasajero. Like, for example, I have one, I have, I have a whim for ice cream. But for a pregnant woman, specifically, you have cravings. 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 Thank you. How old is your, how old is your child or, or daughter? Is it a boy? My child. Uh-huh. My child is one year's. In one year old. Eight months. <laughs> one year, eight months old. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, guys, thank you so much for uh, your opinions. Let me take the picture. 
No moment. Guys, remember this is um, inter teacher. I mean, yeah, Roberto. And me and Roberto Torres uh, I, I, had a problem with the presentation. Yeah, oh, because the the video always interrupt or uh, it's bad connection <laughs> don't don't work. I don't know me. if uh yeah, I don't know if it's about a signal of our device. Yeah, but always uh, have a problem. And we record a video. We record a video, and uh, we plan uh, to send you our um um for uh help me with. <laughs> so you you try to record the video, but yeah, yeah. Uh, no problems. Always you have problems, or you didn't have problems. I have problems. No, we had problems with a with a signal. With the With connection, or... yeah, always. Mm, can you try to use a different device? Yeah. Uh, well, about... keep on trying. If you can, if you can do it for tomorrow, don't worry. I will give you until tomorrow. I mean, yeah, I will give you till tomorrow. Okay. You keep on trying. Next week. All right. Okay. <laughs> not tomorrow, Saturday. Not next week. All right. Well, guys. Um. Guys, remember you are on pre-intermediate three. That means that you are going into intermediate, which is a little bit more advanced than before. So I'm trying to give you these activities so you have a time to practice. Because like I said, when you finish the class, you don't have time to interact with other people and speak English, right? This is your only time during the day to have an actual practice with the language. So I need you to be a little bit more proactive because remember, it's not just about acquiring the knowledge and having the knowledge in your head. It's about producing the language. And if you don't practice, it's going to be more complicated for you to do it later on. So please get more involved in the class, right? We're going to have a lot of speaking activities and I want you to be more involved. Right? Because I really want you to practice and I really want you to improve. Okay? Well, okay. that's it for today. I thank you so much for everything. I we, I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I see you on Monday. Yeah. Bye, teacher. Bye. Enjoy. You too.